everybody at home. This is Miss Matus. Welcome to the English class. How are you today? I guess you are very happy today. Miss Matus too. So we are going to have a beautiful activity today. We are not going to develop, well, certain things that we are going to do. We just have a beautiful topic that is new, a new concept for you, but we are going to deal with with a very positive way, right? Today is a new month. We are in May. Today is May. The number, number is four, 2020. Today is Monday, right? Today is Monday and today is very hot. So today is sunny, right? But where I am, where is Miss Matthews going? I have a handbag. I have some money to buy things and a shopping list. Where am I? Look, let's just start reading. I am in the supermarket and I have a beautiful song that it deals with the topic. Let's just start with this song. Track 30, song, going to the supermarket. My car is hey, on time to talk on Wednesday. See ya, excuse me. Look at the shelf. Going to the supermarket, looking at the shelf. Are there any apples? Is there any cheese? Put them in my cheese? car. No, I just want to the checkout. shopping list okay this is my shopping list right we are going to start putting in the cart meat eggs pasta rice cereal toast tomato onion Okay, in the supermarket, we can find lots of things. For example, help me, we have mm, cheese. We can find pizza, soup, apples, bananas, oranges, grapes, strawberries, grapes, lemons, carrots, meat, Delicious. Oy, we can find a delicious fish. Excellent. What else? Eggs, chicken, soup, water, milk, vegetables and fruits too. I like it. Cucumber, lemons, potatoes, pineapple, onions. Carrots, bananas, tomatoes, papayas, apples. We have a hamburger too. Chicken, come over here. Rice, peas, toast, milk, yogurt, cereal. Hey, we have different products here, such as a pizza, instant rice, cereal bars, pasta, popcorn, water, juice, cookies, cereal, pasta, lots of things to buy. But we are going to follow the shopping list. The number one is the meat. Excellent. Take the meat and look. Here is the price. How much is the meat? 
four, four pesos, four pesos. Excellent, put it in the kind. What else? Eggs. Are those eggs? No, it's the bread. Okay, here we have the eggs. How much are the eggs? Three pesos, very cheap. Okay, number three. Go ahead. Pasta. Is it the pasta? No, they are crackers. Pasta, where are you? Oh, here we have a pasta. Also, it is pasta too. But I prefer spaghetti. Okay. I will carry spaghetti. How much is the spaghetti, chicos? Two pesos, right? What else? Number four. Rice. Where is the rice? Where is the rice? Is it the rice? No, of course not. It isn't. We have here the rice. Five pesos. Okay, what else? Number five. Where is the cereal? Is it the cereal? No, it isn't. It's a chicken, right? Number five. Cereal. Oh, it's over here. It's over there. Cereal. Oh, very big. Number six. Toast. Toast. Here it is, four pesos, four pesos. Look at the price, excellent. Oh, seven, tomatoes. Where, where are the tomatoes, chicos? Come here in the vegetable section. Tomatoes, no, they aren't, they are bananas. Tomatoes. Very good. Mm. Delicious. How much is it the tomato? Three pesos. I'm going to put the price in order to check out at the end in my shopping list. And the last thing am I going to buy? Onions. Is it an onion? No, it isn't. Those are lemons, right? Onion. Here it is. The onion is expensive. Seven pesos. Oh, okay, I finished to buy everything. I'm going to keep my shopping list. And now I'm going to the checkout. Let's go. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Did you find everything you were looking for? Yes, excellent. excellent. Okay, so eggs, three pesos. Pasta, two pesos. Okay, stop. How much is it at all? How much is it? I can count. I don't know. How to pay? Oh, what a mess. I, ha I guess I have an idea. Today, we are going to learn a new symbol. It's a new symbol for you and me. It is very helpful. It is addition symbol. It means plus. Plus, oh, very helpful. Plus, and another symbol. This is equal sign. Equals. Equals, right? So, we have how much is for for the pasta, how much is it? Could you pass me the pasta? How much is the pasta? 
two pesos. Well, write number two here. After that, plus, plus, then the eggs. Then eggs are three pesos. Okay, how am I going to do this, this uh, statement? Two pesos plus three pesos, it, it means that we are going to put together, right? To put together. Come on, let's check. I will take out my money. Two pesos. <clears throat> Two pesos plus three pesos. One, two, three equals one, two, three, four, five. Five pesos. Five pesos. Okay, the eggs and the pasta are five pesos at all. Are you agree? Yes. Here you are. Thank you. What else? What else do you have? Onion, seven pesos. Seven pesos, okay. Seven plus tomato three pesos plus three pesos how much is it how much is it seven let's take out the money come on guys help me at home seven one two three four five six seven and three pesos one two three this symbol plus means that you have to put it together. So we are going to put it together and we are going to start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten pesos, very easy. Ten pesos. Ten pesos. Ay, right, come on. Come. Here you are. Thank you. The tomato and the onion are already paid. Okay, let's continue. Four pesos toast. The toast is four pesos. Okay. Four pesos. What else? And rice, five pesos. Five plus five pesos. How much is it? How much is it? Or equals four plus five equals four. Okay, we have four plus five equals Let's just start putting the chips or the money. One, two, three, four. Plus, it means put it together. One, two, three, four, five. How equals, how much is it? We put together the coins and we are start counting. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine pesos. Four. Ay. Four plus five equals nine. Very good. Now let's take the money. For you. Here you are. And the last product. Four 
four pesos meat. For the meat, just four pesos. We don't have any other product? No. No, okay, four. One, two, three, four. Very good, excellent. Have a nice day. Thank you. This one is your ticket. Ah, the ticket. Don't forget the ticket is very important. Well, let's start keeping our products. Here we have the product. And we are going to start keeping them, right? You have to keep your bag with you when you're going to the supermarket. Remember that, it's very important. Rice. Toast. Pasta. Onion. Tomato. Eggs. And the meat. And the meat. Okay. Do you remember where do you remember what Miss Matus bought? Yes? Uh well, I'm going to ask you just two questions. Miss Matus bought any or some cheese? No, she said she didn't buy any cheese. What about onions? Yes, very good. I bought some onions. Well, an onion. Okay, I hope you like this video a lot and it will be helpful for your work today. Today, you have to go inside your notebook and start doing the first exercise that include addition. Addition, remember, plus, put it together equals you have to count all the material or the chips as well as you want i send you a kiss and i say bye bye have a great date